My name is Mike Houston and I'm a regional disability integration specialist for FEMA Region 8 in Denver. Our job is we work with states in Region 8. I have six states that I work with to build relationships with them and then through them work with local jurisdictions for their planning and then through that bring the disability community, the access and functional needs, you know, such as senior citizens and things of that nature together, creating lasting, lasting relationships. And we, work, we talk about planning. Uh, what are your gaps? What are your resources? And how do we make sure that we're reaching and planning and, and preparing for the whole community? My parents and extended family are deaf. Uh, sign language was the primary language used. I, I personally had a head injury when I was four, five. Uh, and I'm completely deaf in my left ear. And I've, when I was in my 20s, I lost 60% of my functional hearing in my right ear. So I can talk, but I don't hear very well. So I you know, rely on captioning, sign language, facial cues, lip reading, all of these things. So it makes it interesting for me personally because information is king and I need to make sure I'm getting the right information and then conveying that. It kind of gives me a unique opportunity to use my own life experiences. I think having that communication background kind of gave me an understanding, in a way, uh, people with disabilities and some of the struggles they may face. Don't be afraid of people with disabilities. Embrace them, include them, find ways to include them. You'll get better as a result. You'll broaden your outreach. You'll have better understanding empathy, if you will, for people who have invisible disabilities like me. This is a great opportunity to celebrate what people with disabilities have been doing for, for a long period of time, but it's also to, I don't know, make it better for them, you know, by including them and, and enriching more companies with diversity. We have a long ways to go. We've come a long ways, but we still have a long ways to go. And I'm just thankful that I took the road, road less traveled to be where I am today. And uh, working for FEMA has just been by far the most rewarding experience of my life. My name is Mike Houston, and I am FEMA.